Um, one of our uh, prayer partners and uh, Next Skips coordinator, her name is Linda, she spoke about a bride without uh, blot or blemish, I believe. And uh, she was basically talking about, I loved how she started out by just kind of saying that uh, sometimes I feel like I've got a lot going on in my life and I'm not even close to kind of having things together. And I thought that that was really, really uh, interesting because I think that that's probably something that we all kind of feel in our lives. You know, it's like, and then when we try to, when we start to feel like, man, I finally feel like I'm getting something together in my life, something else kind of falls apart or needs some tightening up or fixed or, you know, and that's just kind of the, the nature of kind of life. You know, I think we all kind of feel uh, that way in one way or another. So when she was kind of started like that, I thought, boy, this is going to be an interesting message. And uh, it definitely, definitely was. Anything jump out at you when you were listening to her? And if not, I can keep on talking a little bit more. I was I got a couple other things. Uh, not a whole lot, except, I mean, I thought it was funny that she, I mean, because I think well, a lot of us do that. It doesn't have to be just a wife submitting to a husband. But I had yeah. how she said, that was a hard one for me. And I think that's a hard one for a lot of people. Submission. Yeah. Submission yeah. to a boss. They, a lot of people don't respect authority enough or have issues with authority. Yeah. And we're, as Christians, if we can't submit to uh, authorities in our life, how are we going to submit to God? Because it yeah. ultimately comes down to submitting to God. And if we're submitting God and we trust God with the process of giving us a husband and wife, then we trust that we will even each other. They'll even each other out as husband and wife. Yeah. So, you know, I thought it was interesting, you know, that I, I would like her honesty and it was great that she was honest. And you know what, that one I struggle with that one I've struggled with and yeah. I've worked on and I've gotten better. And, uh, that was probably the, the part that, uh, stuck, stuck out. It, it was interesting cause she, she just got in there, just showed a little bit of that and said, okay, we're done. Like yeah. she just kind of, oh, so we've had enough. And that was kind of, yeah. I wasn't, I was like, that was like, you know, I'm like, okay, we're done. Yeah. I, I, she, it was abrupt ending. That was a, that kind of, that yeah. stood out to me too. I was like, okay. That's her style. It's like, okay, yep. That's what we get. Yep. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. I think that it's easier to submit to someone who is maybe making right decisions or that you trust more. And it's harder to submit to somebody maybe less depending on like even if they are less or not i mean our perceptions are way off but one thing's for sure well it can be way off but one thing's for sure our submission to authority in our lives because we all have authority in our lives you know i had a mom and a dad that was authority you know uh had bosses that's authority i've got a board that's authority you know and how we submit to uh, people in authority um is really a reflection i think of how we submit to god people that struggle submitting to leadership here in the earth it's just a, a kind of a tie tale of boy that that might be something else going on in my life too that's uh, something we can always think about so yeah it's an interesting message that's for sure yeah the only other thing also that just came <clears throat> to my head was there is a lot of um there is a lot of um what, what, what's the word i want similarities between uh, and almost almost like they go hand in hand submission and trust yeah, yeah, you yeah. can't trust somebody. Yeah. You can't submit to them. Yeah. You don't submit to them. You don't trust them. Uh, another good example be that is uh, if you drive in the car with somebody you don't yeah. trust and you're afraid they're going to get an accident or, or you uh, you or you trust them that they're going to drive and get you someplace safely. Yeah. You're putting your sum you're submitting to their driving yep. and you're su submitting it. You're, it's not your job to judge them if they're driving. And yeah. you're trusting to sit in the car while they're driving. Yep. You're submitting to their driving, and you're trusting that they're going to get you to from point A to point B. What a great way of putting it. And you're hoping that they're driving good. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Well, good stuff. So 